I have the privilege of teaching a group of 20 seniors in their liberal arts capstone class. And I asked them the first day of class, why did you stay at WLC? And there's two things that they say. It's Christian to the core. That said, <clears throat> there is one event in my life that uh, I didn't think this would be emotional. <laughs> It is a God moment. So, so for those of you that aren't overly familiar with it, that's called the helmet catch. It's arguably the greatest catch in the history of the NFL. David, I love you, but I don't even know how Eli escaped that. I mean, I mean boy, a little, uh, little Houdini maneuver there too. So that was pretty amazing. But just like David made that catch, which led to the New York Giants winning the Super Bowl, David also caught Christ. And he's a huge proponent of his Lord and Savior, and he's here today to witness and encourage us. It was fantastic. I mean, like, but there was this woman, and she had all this joy emanating from her face. She's singing to God, and she's just, ah. And I just couldn't get my eyes off of her. And this script releases into my spirit. 24 years old, NFL special teams, rookie of the year, Giants rookie of the year. Every dude in here would want to trade place with me. I don't have to enjoy this woman or we can be invited into the kingdom of Christ, uh, the kingdom of our Lord. And I love what Revelation chapter 11, verse 15 says. It says that someday the kingdom of this world will become the kingdom of our Lord.